everybody. Happy Wednesday. It's time for Paint Talk. Dion here. And Matt is here as well. Hello. Guys, I have been working on some extremely colorful abstracts today. It's been a wonderful day in the studio. I actually used all the same colors on these three pieces, but did them all in a totally different way. And I was kind of calling it, hey, it's a different rhythm. Papa Mac and Irene, hello. How are you guys? Say hello as you pop on. Um, I'm going to show you these more up close. I'm going to show you the two that I finished and posted today. And then I want to tell you about a giveaway that's going to include you guys. Um, so, oh, all right. Sorry about that. Matt just signed into a new device. Hello, Denise and Janet and Passionate and Carol, I'm so glad you guys are here. I have been standing here in the studio since about one o'clock painting on paper and canvases. Look at that paper over there. All the same colors, just totally different rhythms, different vibes for each piece. So i um, super excited about those, but I also was fumbling through some drawers and found a couple of things that I remembered I was gonna give away to someone here. What? Yes giveaway and so i'm going to show it to you tonight and then i think what we'll do is on friday night for friday night live we will give these away um and we'll just need to decide if we're going to give them away mm -hmm. to one person or two people so happy birthday shaz i'm so glad you're here with us and spending your birthday with us in the middle of the night 2 30 a.m in the uk happy birthday thank you for the hearts thank you for the thumbs ups that you're giving me right now um What's happened since Sunday? Have we done anything other than just worked and painted and Matt hung some curtain rods, but there's not curtains yet. So those are coming. Um, hello, hi, my Michelle, hi, Becky and Callie. I'm so glad you're here. Okay, so two things I wanna show you. Those of you that are in the Creative Connection, we were talking about doing <clears throat> an art journal for January. So this is what started my art journal process today hold that where is it oh hello i had it already right here for me to see so i just scribbled some colors on my card all right same colors four different designs different rhythm so this is one that i have been working on i'm not sure i'm done but again I'm sorry i'm having trouble hearing you Um, I don't need your help, watch. <laughs> she just asked me a question and I've never spoken to her before. How do you turn these things off without saying, don't, don't talk to me anymore, lady? <laughs> ah, she's just supposed to keep track of time, the weather, and my weight. That's all. I am not familiar with any watch talking to me how did that even happen all right so same colors guys this one is totally obviously more abstract i'm super in love with it these are 36 by 36 but my art journal that i have asked the creative connection to do is what inspired this today again same colors totally different look totally different look we're gonna paint today guys so hang tight but you're going to paint Totally different look, a little more obvious. Am I right on what this could possibly be, Matthew? Yes. You think? What? Or do you see like a dolphin or something random? I see. Okay. You don't want to know what I see. All right. So again, same colors as the one right next to it. Just a totally different rhythm going on. And then I found this paper. I've never painted on paper before. But it's got like this rusty red texture. Look how thick it is. And it comes on this huge roll. And I thought, OMG. So again, same exact colors, but again, a different interpretation of kind of the same painting. Um, I'm really in love with this paper. It comes on a huge roll. It was literally ten dollars. Did, did you tell them how you came across the paper? Funny story. Is it funny? I don't know if it's, it's funny. It's kind of funny because Dion never goes shopping, and we went together to the 
We went to Lowe's. Uh, we went to Lowe's. To get I a few love things. this though. And look at it. So hold on. I'm gonna let you tell your story, Fancy. So look at the color of it though. Okay, ten dollars for an enormous amount of roll of paper. It's super thick. Supposed to um, hold on to water. Anyway, I don't know, but I am in love with this. And again, it all came from me just look, doing this in my journal today, which I have challenged that all the people in my journal or in my group to do a journal. So this encouraged all three of these paintings today. Now let me gently lay this down and Matt, tell your silly story. So she just, I asked her, I said, would you, you know, like to go with me to the store, get some paint supplies, get some paint in the room. She said, yeah, sure. So she, she's, she's with me at Lowe's and I left her to go get some electrical things down the electrical aisle. I come back and she's halfway down the paint aisle and she's got this big grin on her face. I never go to the paint store. She was in heaven. I'm like, what are you talking about? This all this stuff is normally here. And she's like, "Oh my god, look at this! Oh my god!" You sound super dramatic, and, and I did not was, sound like that. She had this grin, and she couldn't walk five feet without stopping and looking at something. I thought she was a kid in a candy store. It was pretty funny. So I see this great roll of paper, but it was in the it's in the aisle where like the drop cloths are. Look how much. Do you know how much I can paint on this? For $10. That's all right. All you have to do is write some words down, Jasmine. Just start with some words. And I have that over there, but I never go. So I'm standing there and I'm looking at the drop cloth and I'm looking at, you know, the brown paper that the, the painters use to tape off the woodwork. And I see this and I'm reading the description. And I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I can paint on this and practice and play. And like, I love the color of it for a more dramatic look. So that went over there, even though the canvases I think are really pretty and I'm really happy with them. I'm not sure if I'm done. I like the paper the best. Um, so yeah, Jazz, just write on a piece of paper, stick it in a folder and write the words. Yesterday I said words that were a little more aggressive than the words I used today. Just saying. Yes, Texas. It, I think it's actually used to protect flooring when you're painting. That's correct. Yes, it is. But I decided it was going to make beautiful paintings. So I want to start on something new with you guys today. And I'm in my overalls from DIY to go-go. They're camo, corduroy, and they're huge. So a little bit different for me. But I don't care because I literally came home and put them right over my gym clothes. Um, Rob Gloria. Rob Gloria, thank you for the card that you sent to Matt and I. We are so appreciative. <laughs> Listen to this. Okay. Heather Mischewski. Okay. She said, Matt, I just watched Dion paint from September, and you guys started singing Grease Summer Nights. You then started naming country singers like Kenny, Willie, and George. Well, my 11-year-old yelled from upstairs, tell Matt not to forget about Dolly. Bye. Don't forget Dolly. Dolly Parton. How could you forget Dolly? Parton? Now I was Dolly for Halloween once. For real. Yeah, she was pretty good. For for real. Okay, these are the things I want to give away. These are two paintings that I did in the YouTube membership group that we have. Uh, these were two tutorials, and I found them in a drawer and remembered I was going to give them away to you guys. So I would really, really love. Um, for you guys to join us Friday night and we'll play some games like we normally do. And I want to either give one to one, one to two people or give both of them to one person. I'll let you guys decide, but we're going to give these away. Uh, these were again, a tutorials that I did inside the YouTube group. And I would just absolutely love to give them away to one or two of you guys. Um, I love the colors. Okay. So join us Friday night, 8.30. Um, and let's get painting tonight. I just posted those two huge ones that we started on the other night. Um, I finished them, got them on the wall. I absolutely love them and I named them. And when the sun rises, we dance. Because I like to dance. 
Um, okay, so you guys can see, does anybody see inside behind this purplish pink color that there is a outline of some sort of face? You see it? Yep. This one's 24 by 24, so we're going a little bit smaller. I have an idea that I want to do a mostly abstract face. So I want to do lots of layers and lots of color, but in, amongst all of this, I want to be able to see eyeballs, maybe a part of a nose and some lips, maybe an ear and a shape of a head. I've never done anything like this before. Are you guys up for it? I'm a little nervous. I am nervous too. It could very well get painted over, but let's do something we haven't done before. Like I said, this inspired all of these three paintings today that I have been working on. I'm not sure they're done, but I am I am very, very happy with them. Derek says, sounds interesting. Derek, that's what I say when I'm uncertain of what she's doing. That's, that's all right, Derek. You can be <laughs> totally uncertain, and I'll be honest with you, I'm a little uncertain as well. Um, Picasso Dion, right. Um, so I'm thinking, that I want to get in a bunch of colors. Uh, I had so much fun doing these paintings today. And um, if I can be really sweet to Matt, I'll get him to bring in the two that we started the other night. Remember they were on four foot canvases and I just started going across the canvas. Those are completely finished. Um, and I would love if Matt would walk into the other room and bring them in here in just a second. Hi, Carla, thank you so much. I'm so glad you have your painting and love it. Um, all right, so let's jump in with our first color. I'm going to get some white. And if you guys have any questions at any point, we have nine days until the journal comes out. Nine days what until our new, say? brand new issue two comes out. We have Quita so Allen of All Shabbed Out on the cover. I am going to reveal nine my. Nine days. <sighs> nine days. Did, did we sing to Shaz? No, but we're going to. Are we? Yes, we are. Like before we leave, or are we doing it now? We can do it whenever you want. Happy birthday Day to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Shaz. I'm sorry. Those of you on Instagram, Shaz is over here on the YouTubes. Happy birthday to you. God, that's so dramatic. It's like you want to hear your own voice. Well, I mean, when it sounds like a songbird. Mm. Songbird, you guys. Songbird. All right, I'm going to start layering some colors here. Now, I want you to, to just be patient with me. <laughs> just be patient with me. I have about 48 colors on the floor. And Matthew? Janet's, uh, Janet from another planet. She says, my intuitive has five creepy faces, so I had to do more layers. <laughs> what, Janet? Her uh, intuitive painting that she oh. was working on. She got a little frustrated with it, and she kept working on it, and then ended up having some creepy faces, so she, <laughs> she keeps adding to it. Creepy faces. Apparently, that happens, and it's a pretty common practice, so I'm going to get some different layers on here. Chad, you're getting a lot of happy birthdays over on uh, YouTube, so they're sending you a lot of love. Chaz is such a great supporter. I see her on everybody else's video. I think I saw her on Llewellyn's earlier, which is how I knew it was her birthday. Um, but I see, I've see i seen her on Kelly's and every, baby, you need to lay down, sissy. So I used chalk to kind of do a face, just to kind of give me a visual and show you guys what I have in my mind. We're gonna use different textures, different mediums, and we are going to draw part of a face, a random face. We can give her a name if we want to, but first we have to decide if this is gonna work for me in any way, shape, or form. So, so baby, I'm just saying, um, again, if you're just popping on, please join us on Friday because I'm going to give these away. 
Matt will have some questions prepared and we will have such a great time going over these. All right, so I'm gonna come back in with light magenta. All right, Matthew, what were you gonna ask? I was just wondering how your day went. Uh, well, I was in here from about one o'clock. I booked flights to Albuquerque because we're doing a VIP event with only eight people in one session and then eight people in the next session in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Uh, Debbie and I and Kenise and Miss Melanie Whitaker, and then we're doing an online workshop. So everybody in the entire world can watch and paint from the comfort of their own home. I haven't done one in a while. So I'm, I'm like I said, I'm really excited about doing that. Um, but you can get those tickets on my website. And I booked my flights, did that today. Uh, Rob, I finished the walls uh, in our bedroom and then I hung, we painted. Uh, the, painted the bed. Painted, Dion painted the bed. I painted the, we have some existing curtain rods. We took the old curtains down, but we kept the rods and we repainted them like a gold color. I put those up today. I'm waiting on the, uh, the curtains. curtains to get here so we can decide on the ceiling color. So that's kind of where we're at in the process right now. But we had mom look, mom came over, mom looked at all the swatches. We're good. I think we've got it down to two. <laughs> Thank you, Michelle. Just posted the link on YouTube. Um, and I see some of you that are coming to Albuquerque. How fun is that, you guys? I see you. Um, I actually did not do the magenta, like I said. When are you flying in Friday? Oh, I'm not flying in Friday, so see, I'm flying on Thursday. Flying in Thursday. Hi, Lolly. Hello, Irma. How is everybody? You guys, I'm so thrilled you're here. Um, I am going to get a palette knife. Oh, this is Farrah Meeker. Hi, Farrah. How are you? She says, I finished my first floral canvas today. I haven't painted a canvas in 25 years since high school art class. I loved it. Thank you for all your inspiration. Well, congratulations. That's awesome. You're so welcome, Farah. I'm glad you had a good time. I'm glad you did it. Go for it. Super pumped for you. All right. Irma, it was Shaz. It was her birthday today. It is her birthday. It is her birthday today. That's Not correct. was. It still is. That's correct. She's about two and a half hours into her birthday. Girl, put your records on. Just go feel that you're How was your day, Matthew? My day was, you know. It had its ups and downs. I was real busy this morning. We shipped packages this morning, went to the grocery store, went to the health food store, hung curtain rods, and then I had a little bit of downtime. I had lunch and I got caught watching the movie. Got caught? I did. I got caught. Like I caught you or what no, do you no, mean? No, no, no. I got caught. It was a good movie. I haven't seen it in a while. I wanted to watch it. So I had to I had to sit there until the end of it. Yeah. Well it didn't end till like two forty five. You know. Yeah, I bet everyone feels sorry for you that you watched a movie today. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they are. But <laughs> <laughs> it was kind of slow at old school electric today. Weather wasn't great today. It was rainy, rainy. All right, so I have my turquoise and teal, and I am gonna mix them up. I turned my canvas a little bit sideways. Farah, I watched today. Interstellar. Interstellar. That is correct. Pretty good movie. I had to, I've had to watch it two or three times to really um, understand. It's pretty deep. The the time continuum, gravity, time concept. Once I got it, it makes a lot of sense, which make it made it even a better movie. So it makes me sad, though. It's a very sad movie to me. Um, people are wanting to know 
how are you doing your canvases on the wall? How are you hanging them? How is this possible? Ah, Hello. Matt built this in our YouTube group last month. Um, so he has a one by, you want to tell him, babe? You can, it's fine. So there's a strip on the wall and we have a, he put a canvas, like a tarp on it. And he put this little strip of wood into the studs, studs behind the wall and it secured it really well. And then he, about every 12 inches, he put a screw. And so I'm just able to put my canvases up and I'm loving it because I like to work on the floor a lot, but I also love having the big paintings up here. I also, this means I can just have more space. So I have them on the floor and on the easels and on the wall all at the same time. And it also makes a pretty good look when I'm photographing too. Okay. So we're just going to get some more colors in here. I'm actually going to go back to the bright blue that we were doing just a second ago. And now I'm going to get some white. And then I'm going to draw that lady's face back on here. I don't know who she is. We're going to draw her back in here and try to kind of see if we can start working on an abstract profile. Probably going to see me get frustrated, so there's that. Um, Gavin has a question. Hi, Gavin. My question is, I'm painting something okay. all white, and okay. I want it to look snowy. So, can I just only use white wax, not clear, or do I have to clear first? And also, can I put glitter or mica in the white wax? You can put glitter in there, bud. Um, but I really would rather you put clear on it first, just to protect your protect it um unless you're super familiar with white wax it would be a little bit easier for you to put the clear on first it will act a little bit as a, a barrier in case you put too much white on there or you could use a product like big top or liquid patina or something from another brand that i'm not familiar with put a little paint inside it and treat it like a glaze and then you can brush it on and then wipe it back so there's some there's some ideas for you, Mr. Gavin. Hello, Delisa Dixon. Delisa Dixon was tardy tonight, honey. That's okay. I know it's okay, but I'll mark it down in my book. Oh my goodness. Well, she missed our song to, to Shaz. Delisa has a negative star tonight. Negative gold star, Delisa. Oh my goodness, negative Delisa. Negative gold star. He's on fire tonight. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> She hears somebody. I don't know what's going on. Oh my goodness. She's a mess. She is getting more and more of a mess the older she gets. It's like she's in her cranky years, even though she's sweet. Uh, Maggie Lynn, who are you giving away? I'll More show you pieces. these two. These were taught in my in our YouTube membership. They were just little tutorials. And both of them, we're going to give both of them away on Friday night. Um, but you can actually make your glaze, Gavin, if you want to. You can make your glaze by using one of those products and putting just a little bit of paint in there. Hi, Lou. All right, let me put that on there. Sorry about that. How's the weather with everybody today? Everybody snowed in, not okay. snowed in, hot, cold. It was rainy where we were today. Kind of cold weather, kind of gloomy, you know, kind of weather we just want to stay in and sleep a little bit. Gail doesn't let me sleep. She told me before I get to work, I better finish my work. There's <laughs> no time for sleeping. Ask Shaz. Sleeping is overrated. She tells you that all the time. I know. She's up right now, and she's just she's just she, having a good... She's starting her birthday early, and I mean early. It's like 3 a.m. over there right now. I know. Or close to. Anyway. She was on Llewellyn's Live earlier and saying, it's officially my birthday. That's how I knew it was her birthday. Nice. 
Gavin is trying to enter this in a furniture art contest. Oh, buddy, that's exciting. I'm so proud of you. She says, sleep is for wimps. <laughs> okay. I need my black oil pastel. Did y'all tell him I just about, uh, just, did he, did I tell you that I just about let him talk me into doing old school on the ceiling? Just close. Oh, I came close. Rob, you've been so proud, Derek. Woo. It was close, but, um, well, it's going to be gray. Mama Bear came over and said, no. She didn't say no. She didn't say yes. She actually said, Dion, no pink ceiling. Julie Moore says sunny and up to 70 today in Tampa. Well, rub it in, Julie. I'm just kidding. I'm so happy. That does sound wonderful. Never done this before, ladies and gentlemen. Bear with me. Who are you drawing? Are you drawing me? Sure. No, that's not me. I didn't think it My was. My face is a little more square. I'm just kind of doing an outline right now. I really want something cool. I know, right, Derek? It was, it was an almost win, but it was a, really a win. I agree. Fair it's 44 degrees and no snow in North Dakota. Ooh. Very unusual for them. It's a good outline you got going on there, honey. Well, I'm not really sure. Like, I think it has to dry, but you know, I don't want this. This isn't like I'm trying to do anybody in particular. I just need that on there. And I, of course, want it to look like a woman, I think. She kind of looks upset right now. I know. I don't want her upset. She needs to. Need to put a little but bit. But I of mean, smile. I'm not trying to. No, I'm not really like trying to make her look like anything. You need to put some smile lines on there. Maybe some. Honey, I have to add shading and stuff. Oh, okay. I got you. I got you. What are you drawing with right now? Uh, the oil pastel, the black. Doing it. I mean, I'm doing it over when my paint is wet. Um, more than a woman. Okay. More than a woman to me. <laughs> Thanks, Lolly. Good idea. Uh, Texas Road Runner says, How does it feel to have the 100 lives in 100 days over, Dion? It feels wonderful, sister. Feels really good. Feels good to have a break and just not have to be on unless I choose to, which um, I told Matt before I came on, I said, honey, I'm nervous. He's like, what? I said, I think it's, he goes, you're not nervous. You're just excited. You're excited to get in there and paint with your friends. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, okay, here. So this is one I worked on today. I, well, I worked on three today. Um, oh, good y'all are giving Gavin some tips. Thank yeah, you so great. much for that. Yeah. Doing a good job over there on the YouTube. Here I'm never going to get that song out of my head, says Tasha. Okay. More than a woman. All right, so now I can at least see her. More than a woman. Okay. I, mean, I, can, I can sing another song. I have never done this before, so y'all just don't laugh. Oh, uh -oh. kicking over stuff. Don't get paint on those boots. I haven't, not one drop. Don't even say anything out loud. Uh, Kathy Anderson, I've had my boots on all day. All day since I got him from her. Lala and I are taking our, our act to the road. You are? Yeah. It's going to be it's going to be a lot of sarcasm with a little bit of singing. That's your act, huh? Mm-hmm. That's going to be your act. It's going to be a hit. And Lolly wants to go with you on the road? I think so. I think so. Maybe not. I don't know. All 
All right, guys, if you popped on, you're just popping on, don't know what I'm doing. I was inspired today. I just played with my journal, art journal, and then I created three different paintings from just these color combinations, but I gave them all their own story, all their own little rhythm to them. And one of them is right there. I showed them all in the beginning, and I just wanted to do something different that I have never done before. Um, so I'm going to kind of create an outline of a very, very abstract face. And then I'm going to paint kind of over her. So, so we need, Lonely and I need, we need a name. Do you think we did name, honey? A name for you and Lolly to yeah, take sure. to the road? It's going to have a lot of sarcasm and a little bit of singing. Will Lolly sing with you? No, she said she'll, she'll handle the sarcasm, but I've got to take care of the singing. All right. Well, I'm not real sure how that's going to go. I feel like that would be just a whole lot of making fun of Matt. What do you think? I think that's ideal, really. <laughs> I think that's ideal, Lolly. You got a good situation going on, Lolly. Yeah, I think Lolly would probably have the better end of it, I would think. Mm -hmm. For reals. So you said you, this is. It's more of an abstract for you, right? You're well, just... Remy, what do you think this is? I, I don't know. This I'm is just... not literal. <gasps> Seriously? You're starting to irritate me. Woo! Am I really? Do you want me to leave? No, I don't want you to leave. I don't want to irritate you. <laughs> Gavin says the sarcastic singing duo. Can you see it, Gavin? Can you see those two? Llewellyn says, love the painting on the right. Thank you, Gary. Thank you. I showed it up closer, and then I had a couple others that I did today. I've got to decide if I'm I think you're done. Done. I, I think I might be pretty, pretty happy with it. I gave everybody in my Creative Connection kind of an assignment for January to start on a journal, and I've been participating as well because, of course, that's what I want to do. Gavin will join. We can make it a trio. Yes! That would be fun. Haven't done this before, guys. I am totally just playing. I bet. Just trying something new. You know what? I bet we could probably get Carrie Carter to come sing. Wouldn't that be something on stage? I guess it would be. Terry Carter. <laughs> lolly Lolly. Is she on here, honey? She was. I don't know if she is anymore. Derek Carlton says, Lolly and the singing guy. <laughs> ah, Crystal Core Marie Molina, she get on stage and bust it out. She says, I'm here. Hola. Merle Haggard, there yeah, she Carrie is. Yeah, Terry Carter. We just sing a little more, a little okey. Or... Thank you, crazy hair lady. Just I'm just playing there. around, you know. Um, Matthew, will you go get the other two paintings that I asked you to get earlier? Delisa says the old new school. The old new school. Lolly makes it new. Whoa. What? What? Delisa, you get one half gold star. <laughs> Do I need to ask you for a fourth time? Yeah. What? Would you mind going and getting the two paintings that I listed today that I started to, on? I just wanted you to, to bring them to me. I was going to show them so they would see where I left off the other night and where I finished. They're just right out there. I didn't want to leave the camera. See that dog snuck in? Okay, let that dry a second. Okay, so this was one of them that we that we started the other night, and they were both on the wall. And I named it. And when the sun rises, we dance. So this is number two. Remember, we had together. We worked on 
the water and I the different had the horses. Things, it was the this horse. one had a horse, according to Matt. It had a horse coming in drinking water, but it very quickly changed. And uh, I started building up the layers. And um, anyway, these are number two. And it's available now. And then the other one, this one has more purple and red. Thank you, love. So they came a long way from where we were the other night, didn't they? <laughs> They're huge, four feet by three. But we started in and then I had the green Kind of was thinking about originally having a tree coming down, and then I ended up kind of covering that up. Um, but so you can just imagine, this one has a long ways to go. Um, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Um, the creative connection. Um, uh, I will, Lisa. I will sell those as a set. I have them individually, but I had one lady message me earlier that thought is thinking about buying both of them. So I'm open to it. Um, the Creative Connection is still open, guys. So I left it open because I've had a couple people say, can you wait till payday? Of course. I understand. I understand. OK, so I'm wanting something a little bit dramatic. I kind of wanted a face on here. Uh, I've never done anything like this. So this is just kind of an experiment. I thought we would play around with something we haven't done before. Um, Sunday, we're going to start a new piece of furniture. I have a commission that I'm doing for a friend, and so it's huge. It's a buffet. You guys are going to love it. So I'm excited to get that in here on Sunday. Um, and then Friday night, we'll play our game and give away those free paintings. Sound good, Woodsy? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who did you and Lolly come up with the name or? I don't think anything's definite yet. Oh. We'll have to talk to our manager and see what he thinks. Oh, have her manager talk to your manager? Yeah, I'll have my people talk to her people and then we'll have to run back home. See okay. what people through phone through, you know, that kind of thing. Gotcha. Um, Delisa would like to know what she wears for a Friday night date, evening gown or overalls. Ooh, I think I would probably go somewhere in the middle of that. I would probably go with a formal casual look. <laughs> I'm not Sunday best? I'm not sure no. what that means, but that's what I would shoot Here's for. the thing. I want everybody to come as you are. Good night, Carol. Not Carol. I'm having fun, but I feel like I need to keep building and building and building layers. You can build layers all you want. I will. You can. I, I will. Stop you. Um, a sarcasm and song says of Roberta. What more? Crystal Cole Marlena will have. Overalls on top and tutu over the bottoms. Ooh, girl, give it. I bought these overalls from DIY A Go Go. I don't know if y'all can see me like you can on Instagram. DIYGoGo.com. Sorry. Linda Martinez, my connection is bad. Are we supposed to say something to enter to win this time? Two on Friday. No, we just got to be there on Friday. We're going to play a game. And we're going to give those away to somebody that gets the answers right. Uh, it's always kind of random. If you've never been on a Friday before, we uh, just kind of draw names. Um, Shanoa would like to know the painting to your right. Is that acrylic or chalk? This is all acrylic over here. And I will show you better in just a second, Shanoa, so you can see a better idea. Lolly is going to wear her best moo moo. Girl, what I is, love a good moo moo. What is a moo moo? Uh, kind of like what I wear at night, honey. 
Oh, I see. Okay. Like just a, it's not really, it's an old term, but it doesn't touch you. I'm gonna try kind of paint. I mean it does, but just I mean not it does, much. but it just not not much. Can guys get away wearing those? No, 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 no. It's not a guy thing. Not not a mat thing, that's for sure. Well, yeah. I was just curious about the other guys. I didn't even... Just curious. Betty says they were popular when I was young. Yeah, it's got a kind of a um an age not an age thing what am i thinking a time period where they were certainly much more popular um okay so what you guys if you're just popping on um this was my little sketch in my art journal and i pulled it out and then i used all the same colors i got all the same colors out and decided to do three different rhythms of with the same colors so this was one of them and I'm super happy with it. I just can't quite decide if I'm done. I don't know. And then I took the same colors and just put them in a totally different form. What is Crystal Coral Marie Molina? I feel like when I say her name, I'm like getting onto her like I'm her. I'm her you don't have to. Done. You could just say Crystal. But I like saying it. Crystal Coral Marie Molina. You could just say Crystal. She and then says, the second one. What's a man who? What's a Manu? She's calling it instead of a Moo Moo, it's a Manu. That's what awesome. What is that? Is, it, is that, is that it's something? It's a demand that... blanket that she can wear. So this is the same like exact colors, just a totally different look. Again, I'm trying to decide if I'm done. And lastly, I was showing you guys the paper that I painted on, and I think I actually like this one the best. Because it was more random. And well, I just really like this background. So the paper, I don't remember what it said it was made out of. <laughs> it's extremely thick and I love it. Derek Carlton says, ha ha, I just envisioned Matt in a moon moon. Ha ha. <laughs> you know what, Derek? I'm gonna not do that. I'm gonna not think hey, of it. Lisa Dixon's ready to give me money if I wear one. Lisa Dixon, stop right now. Don't encourage the craziness. Don't encourage the craziness. You two, you three, you four, all of you peeps. Okay. I keep now I'm hearing more than a woman. The more movie. than a woman to me. The man move now. All right, so I want to get some fluorescence in here. We got a long ways to go on this, don't we, guys? I also keep would like to know if the paper soaked up uh, the paint. Did the paper really soak up the paint? Question mark. Not really. I mean, it did a good job. I mean, I don't. I don't know. I don't really know how to answer that. I'll be honest with you, Alice. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Lisa Alice. Dick I'm not sure how to answer that. Delisa Dixon. She says, "I didn't even notice you had hee haws on." He look adorable. <laughs> he haws. He haws instead of overalls. They're he haws. He haws. Who said this? What do you think, Delisa Dixon? Delisa, these are from um, DIYGoGo.com. Okay, I got a gift card for my for Christmas present, and so I went shopping, and um, I bought these from Debbie's store. Um, I'm not right now. Where's my fluorescent oh, pink? Oh, get this, honey. This Matthew, is Matthew. Where's my fluorescent pink? I think it's right where you left it, honey. Which is Crystal Coral Marie Molina. She says, "More than a moo moo." Oh. More than a moo moo to me. <laughs> I think we're losing viewers because of your singing. <laughs> that is so clever. That's so good. Uh, Shaz says the paper could roll up and sell overseas. Question mark. Oh no, that's my plan, sis. What? Yes, that paper can be rolled up. I can ship that anywhere. It'd be so much cheaper. That's why I bought thousands of feet of it. Although I didn't. One forty-four day court for Matt to wear a moo moo. <laughs> okay. Oh, now I have. To. Okay. Oh, now I'm committed. I'm getting challenged right now. You wouldn't. Say on our stage outfits would be moo moo, so I have to pick a good you one. You wouldn't wear a moo moo. Like 
you would be too vain to wear a muumuu. I know you. Are they tight? Can I wear one that's like tight? Why would you wear a tight muumuu? I don't know. I've Honey, never a muumuu is just like a thing that goes over you. Like a tent. Yeah. Like a poncho. Well, I could rock a poncho. I could rock a muumuu. But should you? Maybe. Um, call it chic. What is your thought process while doing abstract? Mm. Her thought process is, gosh, I wish Matt would really be quiet, not sing. I am just trying to, <laughs> I'm just trying to, when I'm doing like an abstract like this, I try to find balance, composition, scale, contrast. I think about all those kinds of things. Betty would like to know if your lady has a name yet. She doesn't yet, but she's gonna need one, sis. We're gonna, we're definitely gonna need to come up with one. Okay, this movement thing's gotten way out of hand. I'm getting challenged on YouTube and Facebook. My Facebook friends are over there laughing and saying, "Do it, do it, do it." Robert Gloria has a movement, but he says he's too sexy for it. Wow. Rob. Wow, Rob. Wow, Rob. I'm going to leave that one alone. <laughs> yeah, the gauntlet has been dropped, honey. You can drop it somewhere else. Some other neighborhood. Some other home. Would it really embarrass you? No, but I don't want to see my man in a man move. Especially posted all over the web. You're my husband. What do you like to see me in? Ooh. He's doing this with his eyebrows. Mmm, and they're going up and down. Mmm. <laughs> my word. Oh, you're you're very welcome. It's all it's all too often I uh, I, I mispronounce things, so I'm glad I got that one. Uh, Dion, what is the blue brush? Um, it's a Princeton Select. It is called a flat court. It's a bristle bright flat court. It's kind of stiff. It's more of like varnishing for varnishing. But I'm wanting my strokes to show, my brush strokes to show really vividly. And so I'm using it for that. I've literally used about 18 brushes today. Matt has so many brushes to wash when we're done here. Really? When I think of mums, I think of the show Miss Brown. What for essence do you like? Farah, I like, um, I have goldens, red, and pink right now. Was she asking brands though? Yeah, I just said goldens. Oh, that is a brand. Okay, I'm sorry. Red and pink gotcha. that I'm using right now. I thought those were colors. Sorry about that. That's all right. I don't, I don't mean to annoy you. You're not. Sorry, I'm banging on the wall, guys. Rob says, Miss Doubtfire? Oh, yeah. That's what he would be reminded of it's then. It's a great movie. Yeah, it is. Woohoo! Oh, my stars. He says that a lot, I think. You think? I think so. I think that's I think that's how he says it. It's a British accent. Well, hello. <laughs> I'm not sure what direction to go next, guys. I'm just kind of staring at it, wanting it to be cool, and it's not cool. Like there's nothing chic about this right now. All right. I think I think I'm gonna start a trend. If it has to do with Merle Haggard or Moo Moo's, it ain't happening on this page, bro. Well, it's funny that you mentioned that because it has to do with both, honey. No, no. Yes, Moo Moo's and Merle. <laughs> Delete that left eye. Uh, I am. Moo Moo's and Merle. Moo Moo's and Merle, huh? Yep. yep. Not for my page, ladies and gents. We could start. We could start the Moo Moo and Merle fan 
brigade. It'd be the biggest bunch of dorks I've ever seen. But we'd get a lot of hits. We would you? Get, we would go. We would go. What they say the young ones say. We would go viral. The young ones. Why do you keep trying to age yourself? The youngsters. Uh, Lolly would like to have a Moo Moo Monday. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, you have whatever you want, sweetheart, in your own page. <laughs> <laughs> Silly. I'm just trying something I haven't done before, guys. I am so far from anywhere where I need to be. This is not. Oh, Derek, yes. And he had to add, and some poutine. Okay, Derek. So the Monday night, Moo Moo's and Merle and poutine. Oh, my stars. Derek, <laughs> you and Lolly, are you and Carrie are both grounded. You guys are put in the grounded corner. Um, Patty says your work is amazing. I love, love, love the piece to your right. Thank you so much, you guys. I'm so proud of that one. And this is just something I wanted to do different that I haven't done before. So bear with me or not, just whatever you want to do. Texas Road Runner would like to add mimosas to the Monday. Mimosa Monday and Moo Moos. Oh my word, what have we turned into, Woodsy? You're speechless, aren't you? Yeah, I 44 decor actually beat you to it, Derek. She said, uh, and add poutine for dinner. <laughs> Rob says she's going to put us in timeout. Well, I think Rob, the, you're not there yet, but you might be on your way. I think. And Rob, by the way, um, we received your. Honey, I showed it. I okay, showed it to yeah, everybody. I'm sorry. Okay, I didn't realize you did. Thank it's you. Okay. I didn't get to say thank you. Very kind. Yeah, and, I showed everybody the card. Rob really made appreciate this. the card. Rob It's very thoughtful. I did. I showed everybody right there. Rob sent us this today. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Matt, so you've got your Monday nights. Does that mean you're coming on Monday nights on your own page? Are you setting up a page for Matt's Moo's on Mondays and margaritas with poutine? Boy, it'd take a lot of margaritas to get to make that happen. <laughs> <laughs> we are so far away from where we need to be with this gal, but I feel like it's something. It's, yeah, no, I think it's actually coming together quite nicely. Um, this is one I did today. I also did a couple of others, but uh, that's kind of what we're doing. And I just wanted to try something I had never done before. And I have certainly never tried to do an abstract woman like this. Um, I, I think it looks like more of a woman, but I'm not sure how to make it um, I want it to be cool. And we're I think we're I don't think we're at cool. Uh, Rohini, she says, uh, Tom says. Matt's Mimosa Merle Moo Moo Monday. No, make your make your page, Matt Woods. Go for it, buddy. Should okay. Should I call it Moo Moos and Mimosas? Because that would probably just get a lot of weird hits. You know, <laughs> there'd be there'd be like a lot of weird guys out there just going, "Oh yeah," click yeah. it and go, "Oh no." No, I don't. I don't think that. I, I think that it's possible. Maybe you should start with, um, well, I don't know. This is kind of your thing, guys. I, I'm going to kind of leave you guys to this on this one. <laughs> Papa, Papa was asked if he was going to be in the Moo Moo Club, and Papa said, I'm more of a commando kind of guy. Oh, <laughs> That's fantastic. Uh, Rob, this will be a paid event. It will be. Oh, my. 
And you can tell Matthew, are you guys just, y'all are totally bored with what I'm doing tonight. That's okay though. No, 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 I'm no, no, totally no, on board no, with no, it. No, 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 no. It's I okay see. that y'all are so bored. No, they're not bored, honey. Stop. It's okay. Stop. Really it is. Uh, I hope I say this right. Carla Lynn. I also love to paint. I'm curious, where do you get most of your painting inspirations and ideas? I get inspired looking at Pinterest, but at times I want to paint, but don't know what to paint. Yeah. I know that sounds silly, but it's true. Oh, no. It's so many people get to a canvas and stand there and stare at it, and they don't know what they want to draw or what they want to paint. I, I get it. I find most of my inspiration from flowers, colors, outside. Um, I like to study flowers in the colors that nature intended them to be and just kind of use that as my driving force. Um, I love Instagram, love following different artists on Instagram. I love um, Pinterest. So I've been on Pinterest for years pinning artwork. I have like 10,000 pins on, on the on Pinterest right now. I have all my furniture pieces that I've ever done on Pinterest as well. Oh my gosh, are we making it worse or better? No, I like it. I like it better. You're never bored watching me paint your sweet, Carrie. Thank you. Guess who we have on here tonight? I don't know, sweetie. Tell me. Cheyenne. Miss Cheyenne, up she, in here. She has been busy with school and decided to take a small little break to see her family. Her Aww, family. I'm so glad you did, sister. Taking a break. Somebody had mentioned maybe putting a ring of flowers maybe around her head or no, nope. No. Nope. That's not, not for this one. Not for that one. I love that idea and I love that look, but not for this girl. She's um she, I'm wanting her to be more chic. So she's more than just a woman. She's more than a woman because she's more than a woman to me. Oh, That's I'm just saying. See, see what I did there. Sweetie, you're did, just you're the most clever person besides Crystal there? Molina. You're the cl most clever person. I know Crystal's clever. More than a moon. See, that could be our, my intro song, right? Yeah. I can see That's it. That's great. Like we can see it. We, I can see it. Right, I'm coming in, walking in. It can be more than a moo moo. It's just great. Honey. Right? Yeah. So great. we can talk about other moo moos. We can talk about the process of making moo moos. Really? Yeah. We can talk Do about. Do you think somebody wants to see that or like like participate I mean, in that? There might be a big movement for moo moos. You never know. I mean, we could talk about what you can and can't do in a moo moo. Right? You can pretty well do anything. I mean, you can talk about a lot. There's a lot of topics. Okay. I'm not sure really where to go with this. I need more water in my spray bottle, but my husband's too busy talking about moo moos. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Shaz thinks that she's trying to sort her life out. I think that she's in a state of. Um, in the middle. I think she's in the middle right now. She's trying to figure things out. Yeah, I think that that's where she is too, Shaz. Alice says she looks like a warrior woman. I love that. But I think most women are. Janae says, when I was young, I thought that song was saying, three-legged woman. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we all have songs like that? What's the song that I sing that you get so mad at me about? I don't know. And you're like, that's not what he's singing. We were singing it the other day. I know. Well, I'm trying to remember what it was now. It, it has left my, um, my it's thought process. That sexual feeling or healing. Oh, yes. Marvin so, Gaye or what? It's a Marvin Gaye song. Uh, sexual healing. But I say sexual feeling. And Dion gets really mad at me when I sing it. I don't it wrong. get really mad at you. You get kind of irritated. I just am like, hey, you're singing it wrong. But the only reason I get irritated is because you are just so sure that you're saying it right. No, no. You you argue with me, and I'm like, no, no. Crystal Cole Maria Molina says, I am sorry, Dion. It's been a weird day, and this is making me laugh. 
moo moo magic in the house. Well, you that's know fantastic. What? That I, was the idea. I right? understand, and I understand why. And so, if that's what we can be for you, sister, then I am here for it. Not a big deal. I'm just giving him a hard time because I can, and I think we would all agree I should. <laughs> yeah, because if if you don't give me a hard time, then we go we, we go down the list. We got Lolly, we got Delisa, we got Lisa. And then we have got Crystal and Michelle, got Crystal, Cole, Marie, Molina, even Derek. Tasha Watkins can throw some paint at me every now and then. <laughs> Cheyenne will get on me a little bit. Rob, Derek, for the most part, he's kind of on my side, but every now and then he'll throw throw out a little little something. He likes to say, "Come on, Matt." Yeah, he does. He likes to get on me every now and then. Um, but yeah, that's okay. It's all right. I'm here for it. No, heck yeah. This is fun. I was missing you guys. I really was. That's why I think I got excited. I was like, ah, we get to go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I was in here really early. Um, Sh Cheyenne says, Matt, I want your moo moo to have puff sleeves with a big pink bow in the front. All right, Cheyenne, what are you trying to do to me, girl? <laughs> What are you trying to do to me, girl? Yes, Joanne. And the list goes on and on and on. That is true. All right. So I may just need to take a step back, guys. I'm not really sure what I'm doing. But I think you guys get an idea of at least what I was hoping to come up with. I just think I need to build up some more layers. I may need to paint over her one more time and then kind of bring her back under the surface. And then maybe I need another person over here, back over here in the corner. I mean, I'm just saying. Like Jasmine says, I feel like this woman is in the painting is looking into the distance in a daydream, seeing the different options she has in her life and which road to take. So she's kind of crazy looking right now. I'm not sure crazy is bad. I mean, it's art. I'm just going to keep working on her, but I think I should let you guys go. Or maybe it's just Matt that seems to be needing a break. Just kidding. You guys, thank you so much. Would you, yes, I do, Jasmine. Um, I would love if you guys would come back on Friday night and we'll play some games and we will give these um, away. Both of these were done by myself in a paint tutorial in the YouTube group that we have. Uh, nope, I don't think so either, Julie. I'm gonna, to, you know, there's a lot of confusion and maybe this is my outpouring of confusion um, with this young woman here. So everybody, thank you for being here on Wednesday night for Paint Talk. I appreciate you so much. Um, love you. Oh, well, I guess I'm not seen by. Irene, I'm so sorry. What type of paint is that? Um, Irene, I am also, I apologize. I am also on YouTube and Facebook on a different device. So my apologies to you on Instagram. I did not see your questions. My husband reads the other ones. Um, the paint that I'm using is DIY paint. I'm also using some acrylics from Golden and I'm putting them on here in different combinations. Um, so my apologies to you. All right, everybody, take care. Be well. I hope that your uh, Thursday is wonderful. We have, what do we have coming out tomorrow, Dion? Podcast. Thanks, Lolly. We have a new podcast coming out in the morning. It's actually my cousin. She's a professional photographer. She and I just chit chat like cousins do. And she'll be out at 6 a.m. in the morning. Uh, Creative Connection is still open. I'm going to close it down over the weekend, guys. So if you want to be in the group and paint with us, jump in there, see what it's about. Let me know. Um, also, the online workshop classes or tickets are available now. And nine days till the journal comes out. You listen to Debbie's great. She's so much fun. Everybody have a great night. Thank you for the Moomoo's and Mimosas and the Matt talk. Moomoo -moo Mondays. You know what I'm going to do? Good I'm night, gonna have everybody. my Moomoo -moo and I have my tool belt on. Your tool belt on.
See you. <laughs> See you guys.